the government has been very, quite forthcoming when there's been instances of Russian interference in this country. Um, based on what you just read, they were not forthcoming uh, with the public or with the opposition parties about Chinese interference. With the benefit of hindsight now, did the government err by not telling the public more specifically what China was doing to influence our political sphere? I don't think there was any conscious desire to suppress and to diminish this. I think it was clear that we have not acted as quickly and as thoroughly as we have as a threat that has been growing. And the Chinese one is the one that came into prominence only in the last three or four years. As Mr. Joyce of the National Security, uh, the National Security Intelligence Agency in the U.S. says that uh, Russian interference uh, in the U.S. Uh, came in like a hurricane five, six years ago. Chinese interference, interference came in like climate change. It's longer, persistent, very widespread, and, and very damaging. Um, I think it's, it's clear that, that we have not come to grips with the degree of Chinese foreign influence that does exist, and we have much work to do to do a better job of that. And yes, the responsibility lies with the government of the day to look at how we're dealing with this threat and whether we're meeting it effectively. And I think, as we say, in terms of the machinery of government, we have a lot to improve.